Hi guys, one of those days today. I put this together, tucked everything neatly inside the bonnet. So we got the battery, ESC, receiver all in there. Printed up a little bracket for the action camera to sit on the back here. Put it all in the bag, put it in the back of the car. We went out for our midday run. Well, actually we went to the doctor so we could have a flu jab. But uh, anyway, went out and it started raining. So rather than carry on and go and have coffee somewhere, we came home. And of course, now that we've come home, sat down and eat, eat our toast and drink our coffee, the sun's come out. So I'll give that a little run round the normal track out in the garden there. It's still wet out there, so it'll slip a bit, but we'll give it a run. Okay, that's recording. It's going to rattle around a little bit. I probably ought to put some something in there to dampen that a bit, but we'll we'll leave it as it is for now. That's fresh off the. 3D printer. Right, last time out it was making a clicking noise when it was struggling a bit. I'm not sure if it's the front differential or whether it's where the shaft from the front gear goes into the drive shaft. It might be clicking there. Nearly got all the way up there in one go then. That sounds like that's clicking at the back now. Yeah. I've ordered some new drive shafts. Very unusual for me to do something like that, but I was looking on uh, eBay and they seem to be a particularly good price, which probably means they're junk. But I ordered them anyway. OK, we'll try something a little bit easier for it. It's getting worse, isn't it? All right. Let's have a look, see if we can work out where the noise is coming from. point in going any further with that. We'll have a look inside.
it's much grease on there. I can't really tell whether that's worn down or not. It certainly sounds like it is, doesn't it? So we probably need the metal gear replacements, don't we? I'm just trying to see if there's any way we can take up the slack. No, I think the only fix there is a complete replacement. That's frustrating, isn't it? If that's pushed in, it makes good contact, but that's not going to happen. It's like you need to try and get a washer behind the gear to push it forwards and take up the slack. Thanks for watching. There's always more information down in the video description. And if you like this video, you might like this one up here. And you might like to have a look at my channel over here. See what else I do. Thank you for watching.